We're here in Kansas City shooting a thumbnail for Jeff and Dovey's smooth transition tutorial. I thought a cool thumbnail would be him frozen in the middle of a blurry frame. Um, and what I did is put my camera to manual, but at a slow shutter speed. We had to play with it a little bit to figure out the settings. Ultimately, we ended up with, I had to stay completely still and have him rotate around me. As you can see in these photos, we screwed up a lot. There was a lot of trial and error, and I go into a lot of shoots where it's just like, I don't know how to do that. I've seen it before. I've watched a YouTube video on it before. Let's just give it a shot. So as long as your subject is willing to try with you, then you can create some cool images and have some fun with your photography. You know, this was something that wasn't planned. We were just like, hey, let's shoot a video. And uh, we ended up coming up with something really neat. In the future, I'll probably use this on a job because I have experience doing it and I can charge somebody for, to create something I just did for fun. I encourage you to get out there and just practice. Like, skills that you ha aren't, you haven't mastered yet, just get out there do it and do it again and again and again until it's fully like this camera is your right hand like you don't have to think about it you know slow shutter freeze motion these are my settings um keep practicing even though you're not getting paid still shoot because you love shooting like that is definitely part of the game is the love for photography will show if you just do it anytime anywhere rise to a challenge, try, be uncomfortable, try something that you have not done that might come out like crap. We didn't know. I'm ready to keep experimenting. Earlier this week I shot some boxers and they were punching really fast and I froze some action. They didn't come out that good, but I tried. In summary, if you're trying to get out there and do some motion blur photography, here's the settings that I used and they will be a good starting point for you. It might not be exact. I used a wider angle lens so I could get more of the background I used f18 one fifth of a second flash sync of 164th power you can start there move your shutter down go slower have a steadier hand maybe use a tripod i mean there's so many options i'd love to see what you guys come up with so link your instagrams below in the comments get out there and shoot have some fun